From now till near 2025, 17 weeks remain. In 17 weeks, you have to write at least 15 mock tests. We are going to be conducting very extensive testing on this platform. We have 250 plus centers across India. We have centers in five states in South India, and you can go and physically write tests. We are starting what is called T15 classroom test series from 19 January, and every week, 19 January, 26 January, 2nd February, 9 February, 16 February, 23rd February, 2nd March, 9 March, 16 March, 23rd March, 30th March, 6 April, 13th April, 20th April, 27th. April. 15 weeks 15 tests but you have to commit yourself that you have to regularly test yourself if you're not going to test yourself you would not know which areas you are not good at and where to focus your preparation good evening students in this video I want to cover very simple things five things which will significantly improve your performance in the remaining four months exactly four months remain in need 2025 and what is very very important is first 100 MCQs daily for a week, approximately 700 MCQs. If you don't want to practice every subject daily, that's fine. But on a weekly basis, 700 MCQs and the breakup of the 700 MCQs could be physics, chemistry, biology, 175, 175, 350. Doable. In a week, 700 MCQs, 100 MCQs daily. Second, at least 15 mock tests till need 2025. From now till need 2025, 17 weeks remain. In 17 weeks, you have to write at least 15 mock tests. We are going to be conducting very extensive testing on this platform. We have 250 plus centers across India. We have centers in five states in South India. And you can go and physically write test. We are starting what is called T15 classroom test series from 19 January. And every week, 19 January, 26 January, 2nd February, 9 February, 16 February, 23rd February, 2nd March, 9 March, 16 March, 23rd March, 30th March, 6 April, 13th April, 20th April, 27th April. 15 weeks, 15 tests. But you have to commit yourself that you have to regularly test yourself. If you're not going to test yourself, you would not know which areas you are not good at and where to focus your preparation. Third thing is you have to be brutally honest with yourself in terms of acknowledging your mistake. What happens is we know what we are not good at. But we hope from God that somehow we will be able to do problems of these things on exam day. No. The first very, very important thing is to be brutally honest with yourself, to acknowledge, yes, I don't know certain things. I'm not able to solve questions in genetics. I'm not able to solve questions of regulation of respiration. I'm not able to solve questions of moment of inertia. I'm not able to solve questions of conservation of momentum, whatever it is. It is very, very important. First, you acknowledge your mistakes. Second, you give time to fixing those problems. In these things also, you can practice from recommended MCQs, you can practice from custom test generator, you can practice from DPP generator. For this, you have DPP generator in target batch. You have DPP generator in target batch, use it. But you will not be able to use it till the time you understand that you're not good in certain areas. You have to be honest with yourself, you have to acknowledge what you're not good at, and then you work hard toward fixing those problems. Seven hours of sleep. Some students tell me, sir, I need eight to nine hours of sleep to feel fresh. That's fine. But at least seven hours of sleep. You have to be mentally and physically fit. One hour of light physical activity daily. What is light physical activity? Go for a walk two times, 30 minutes a day. You will feel much, much better. Remember this, guys. Four months, five things. Jai Ho. You can significantly improve your performance. The important thing right now is to figure out those things which will help you study consistently, which will help you focus on your weak areas, which would make you feel better. 10 to 12 hours of studies, 7 hours of sleep, remaining time, whatever you want to do, do it. But don't feel depressed, don't feel demotivated, don't get into FOMO, just be in control of your mental health. That is very important. One more thing I want to tell you is you have to maintain balance between these three things which would be going on. Syllabus completion, revision for the next mock test that is coming up and whatever weak areas you identified from the mock test you would want to study for fixing those weak areas. How do you balance these things? For these two things, keep two to three hours daily and remaining time give for syllabus completion as your syllabus comes towards closure mid-February, February and especially for droppers, this time can keep on increasing but right now keep this a daily discipline of revising, of studying for your weak areas for 2-3 to three hours daily and you'll be fine. So I hope students you have understood. 
we have provided you everything in our target batch in our classroom testing but in the video description i am providing you detailed video of target batch which explains you how to use different things use them judiciously you don't have to use everything especially for example dpp generator custom test generator these are very very useful things you want to do pyqs that is very very useful but remember this do go through explanations if you're not going to go through explanations you're not going to understand what went wrong what you did not understand this part right very very important and don't miss any of the tests at least 15 mock tests we are providing you very good opportunity to test near you we have more than 60 centers in five states in south india of telangana andhra pradesh karnataka tamil nadu and kerala so best of luck all of you i'm finally creating a video after a long time we are not going to do any chit chat on this channel we are not going to do any speculation any astrology what will happen what will not happen if there is a confirmed news from the government on anything about two stage exam or anything else we will tell you where but we are not going to speculate and waste your time and waste our time so tell me in the comment section do you understand what these five things are and i want promise from all of you you're going to take care of these five things you're going to maintain balance between these three things and you're going to maintain balance by giving time to these two things at least two to three hours early all right students